You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, YNR fans. It's Belinda from Soap Dirt, and I want to talk about the big Chelsea Adam kiss that is coming this week. And specifically, I want to talk about the very divided fan reaction on this lip lock on Chatham as a couple and whether Billy Abbott has it coming for all his past shady behavior on Young and the Restless. But before we dive in, please click subscribe if you have not. And if you hear a little bit of background noise, I apologize. I am podcasting from the road. I'm on the West Coast this week, not in my studio, so bear with me if you hear a little bit of noise. For some reason, by the way, I'm also seeing some very aggressive comments here on the channel insisting the Chelsea Adam kiss already happened, that they already saw the episode it happened on. It has not happened yet. It was on the promo that YNR released for the week, and based on spoilers, it looks like the kiss is probably happening on Thursday, July 4th, unless CBS Daytime does a last minute preemption for the holidays. It is still showing a new episode that day on the cable guide and TV guide. So fingers crossed. So if they do preempt, the kiss should air Friday the 5th. So judging from the promo video, it looks like Adam and Chelsea meet in the middle. They both are equally instigating this little slice of intimacy. And we all know it takes two to tango. And then on Friday the 5th, spoilers say Chelsea and Adam make a Act, I assume it's to keep what they did in Maryland a secret. Maybe it stops at a kiss. Maybe it doesn't. And they end up taking a role in the sheets. We will know this week by Friday. Even if it's just a kiss, it is still a betrayal. The division among fans, though, is very interesting. Sally and Adam have a legion of fans, as do Sally and Chelsea. I mean, um, uh, Adam and Chelsea, not Sally and Chelsea. That's a whole other storyline. Um, so some fans feel really bad for Sally being betrayed by Chelsea and Adam. But what's interesting is no one seems to care much about Billy getting his feelings hurt. And a lot of people are cheering the end of Billy and Chelsea if they do end up breaking up. And even the Chelsea Billy haters seem to be divided into two groups. So some of the people hate the fact that YNR paired Chelsea with Billy just to start with because I've seen their relationship called a rape-mance instead of a romance because that is how it started years ago. If you don't remember, Chelsea dropped and raped Billy in Myanmar and then she turned up in Genoa City with his baby in her belly. Nothing romantic about rape. I do not know why soaps seem to treat it lightly in many instances. I mean, over on GH, if you were watching in the 80s, Luke Spencer was a rapist. He raped Laura and they took him from la- rapist to leading man and then later he tried to gaslight Laura and say they were making love. No. It always made my skin crawl, and there's just nothing nice about assault, no matter who's the victim. And in this case, it was definitely Billy, and Chelsea was the perpetrator. The other Billy Chelsea haters just don't want him with her, and they think him getting cheated on is karma for all his past dirty dealings with women. I mean, Billy boned his brother's wife, Phyllis, countless times back in the day behind Jack's back. Billy can be truly awful, disloyal, adulterous you know, a risk taker to the extreme, lots of issues. So I'm with those who think Billy deserves a little karmic slap for his past deeds. But I also side with those who think it's awful that Adam is playing tonsil hockey with Chelsea for a few reasons. First is that he worked so long and hard to win Sally Spectra back. And now this, it's insane. And then there's the fact that Chelsea framed Adam for attempted murder the last time they were a couple. I mean, granted, she was struggling with some serious mental health issues, but still, that's not the kind of thing most people forgive very easily. I will say, of course, Adam has done her dirty so many times over the years, and she forgave him most of the time. So some of the comments about Adam and Chelsea include these. Can't wait. Looking forward to all the drama. That's from Jacqueline X on Twitter. Brittany, a little liar, posted on Twitter. So excited. Took them long enough. Alexa on Twitter disagreed, calling Chelsea with Adam a train wreck, waiting to happen and blaming someone on the inside at the soap who either loves Chatham or hates Allie. Of course, that's Sally and Adam's smush name. Twitter polls have fans much 
preferring Chelsea with Adam over Adam with Sel- with Sally. Spoiler Girl said on Twitter she liked the chemistry between Sally and Billy, and I have to agree there. I do see potential in that scene they had last week, and they have another scene together coming up this week. So Chatham Sin fan on Twitter said, I don't feel bad for Billy. He's always been Chelsea's second choice like Nick was, but Sally doesn't deserve it. A kiss is still cheating. One interesting tweet came from Mermaid Dreams who said, I'll never ship Chatham in this life or the next, but if it gets Billy away from his rapist, then so be it. Another user, Phyllis Cake, said she'd like to see Sally and Billy on a road trip where they walk in on Chatham. And that definitely sounds fun. It seems certain that they're doing some sort of couple shuffles during July sweeps. As a side note, I had someone in the comments telling me July sweeps don't exist. Yeah, they do. There are four Nielsen sweeps period a year, February, May, July, and November. And July 2024 sweeps kicked off last week on Thursday, June 27, and it runs through Wednesday, July 21st. And sweeps means high drama. I totally expect to get some Chatham action, possibly some some Sally Billy action as they comfort each other when and if this comes out we'll see the Chelsea Adam kiss happens this week by the end of the week and it may be more than a kiss and to that person who told me you watched the episode where it happened you watched the episode where the promo happened <laughs> and then the promo was the kiss maybe you tuned out the words next week on Young and the Restless anyway Billy is already uncomfortable with Chelsea's bond with Adam as their caretaking Connor, but Sally seems totally unaware that there might be trouble in paradise. And I don't want to see Sally's heart broken again, but it definitely feels like there is heartbreak ahead. And one of the fun things we have to look forward to if Sally winds up with Billy is a fun smush name. I like Silly. That's one that's been suggested better than Bali at any rate. Bally, I guess it'd be Bally. So what do you think? Who do you want to see? see Adam wind up with Chelsea or Sally and do you hope Billy runs back to Lily or starts a revenge romance with Sally when it all comes out let me know what you think drop your comments if you're not already following us please click subscribe definitely come back soon we are here talking young the restless seven days a week and as always it's Belinda from Soap Dirt thank you for being a loyal listener follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 